poplock and frogged bitches. Mansplaining at its core is simply explaining. However, what makes mansplaining unique is that there are some women of subpar intelligence who are too stupid to understand clear and simple explanations. For example, let's create a fictional scenario. Let's call figure A man one. Let's call figure B unhinged emotional crazy bitch feminist cunt. Figure A says, please could you have that report on my desk by this afternoon, please Janet. But what figure B hears is, all women are bitches and must die. This mental gymnastic process we call the feminist cancer effect. A process which quickly degrades the brain once the subject is infected. And as a result, any rational thought is replaced by a pure concentrated hormone known as the crazy bitch feminist stupid bitches don't have a fucking clue about anything. Little is known about this phenomenon other than it's highly destructive and creates nothing other than rapid degradation of one's intelligence of any organism that is unlucky enough to be exposed to it. Recently, the Swedish team of science isolated the infection and examined the parasite under a 1000 times microscale. This is what their parasite looks like. Truly frightening. At present, there is no known cure. The best method in avoiding this is prevention. Please be aware that any undeveloped or damaged brain that is exposed to feminist literature or opinions is in danger of catching this dreadful infection. And once infected, said brain becomes utterly useless to society and the progression of mankind. If you fear a loved one may be showing early signs of feminist cancer, here are a few signs to look for. If they start throwing around words like racist, sexist or homophobe until they lose all meaning, this is a definite sign that they are infected. They must be quarantined and disowned immediately before the infection spreads. There are many options on how to deal with the problem from this point onwards, but ultimately is your choice. So from all of us at the Institute of Science and Common Sense, good luck and farewell. Poplock and frogged bitches.